Site. Uh, tonight, many women are reconsidering their birthing options in light of the coronavirus. A local midwife says interest in home births is spiking. Our Emma Lockhart has more on why soon to be moms are now avoiding the hospitals altogether and possibly going a less traditional route. Autumn Guerrero is getting ready to welcome her second child into the world, but she never imagined it would be during a pandemic. When the COVID-19 started, I tried not to get myself worked up about it because I do have anxiety and I am slightly a hypochondriac. Guerrero is due in May, but she says the baby could come earlier than that. Fearful of the virus and hospitals filled with coronavirus patients, her delivery plans are now changing. Being in my own house, in my own safety, knowing who's been in and out of my doors, that makes me feel more safe. She's opting for at-home birth, and she's not alone. Licensed midwife Wendy well, Kleckner you know, says more women are now reaching out. Typically, outside a pandemic, <laughs> I have two to four inquiries a week. A week. Um, now I'm getting two to four a day. And Kleckner says Valley hospitals are now cracking down on regulation. Some are now limiting number of people who can be in the delivery room to just one support person. When I found out about the hospital policies changing and everything, I actually like broke down and cried because um, nothing in this pregnancy has gone to plan. And it was just like one more thing that was added stress. Amid fears of contracting COVID-19 at the hospital, one local OBGYN says expecting mothers won't be near sick patients. Labor and delivery units are separate, that uh, pregnant women have a separate triage area. So they're not in the ER with all the folks coming in with fever and cough and flu symptoms. They're in a separate space. For those still uneasy, Kleckner wants soon to be mothers to know they have options. Take advantage of the wealth of resources out there um, because there, there is, there's always a choice, always, even in the middle of a pandemic, there's always a choice. In Phoenix, Emma Lockhart for Arizona's Family.